Malacanang dismisses overall Deputy Ombudsman Melchor Arthur Karandang. The Office of the Ombudsman receives the dismissal order from the Office of the President or OP Tuesday afternoon. Executive Secretary Salvador Medialdea confirms Malacanang's dismissal order against Karandang Wednesday. Acting on the complaint of the Volunteers Against Crime and Corruption, the OP found Karandang guilty of graft and corruption and of violating the Government Code of Ethics. In a statement, Presidential Spokesperson Harry Roque says, quote, The decision was reached after giving Mr. Karandang the appropriate opportunity to respond to the charges made against him. The OP says Karandang showed partiality when he spoke in public about Duterte's bank transaction documents from the Anti-Money Laundering Council but did not speak about the termination of the Ombudsman's investigation into the President's wealth. Incoming Ombudsman Samuel Martirez says he has yet to read the decision. When Malacanang suspended Karandang late January, then Ombudsman Conchita Carpio Morales defied the order, citing a Supreme Court ruling that the President cannot impose disciplinary action over Deputy Ombudsman. Karandang is serving a seven-year term that expires in 2020.